Hey, it's Black Widow Molly, and I'm here today to do my October favorites. Unfortunately, October for me is usually a very busy time of year because I have to help out a lot more than I usually do. And my mother got very sick this month, and so I um, have been helping her with that. I myself was sick again with that rash. It flared up yet again. Um, I am now getting over it. So, yay. I was told in a comment on a previous video that apparently I made somebody very uncomfortable by looking here, over here, <laughs> at the screen rather than looking at the camera. Um, I would like to address that here and now before I begin my favorites videos. I do have severe degeneration of the eye. I have astigmatism, which um, causes my eyes to be oval. Oh, oh oval rather than round. Um, it is very difficult for me to wear contact lenses at all. In fact, darn near impossible in my left eye. Um, so really, if you ever see me with contact lenses, it's going to be for 20 minutes and that's about it. Um, so I'm going to try to do this video blind with my glasses over here. Um, so I want you to realize this is very difficult for me. Um, without my glasses I am legally blind so but with them I can drive and everything you know everything like everyone else can do so see if we can do this um, the only thing I can see on my camera is I can't see where the lens is but I can see the blue where the little lights are on the side so that's kind of helping me realize where the lens is so just so you all know, this is we'll try it. If I let if I think it's okay, then we'll do it again. Um makeup. This is the Rimmel Scandalized Mascara. I really did like this this month. It was one of the few things I was able to wear. So it's pretty cool. It's got this really huge brush. You know, that's huge to me. Um doesn't really work for doing my under lashes, of course because um, the brush is so big. Uh, another thing I've been using this month is the Spectrum Cosmetics Sugar Kisses Lip Polish and this is in Melon. Now if you can look here yes I'm checking the camera yeah it's like sugary if you can tell I've made a pretty big dip in that. It's awesome. I put this on like every day. Um, this other thing that is really good is the ELF Eye Primer. And this is just in sheer. I just wear it every day under my eyeshadow if I wear it. Um, the eyeshadow I've been wearing the most is this Wet n Wild Trio called Silent Treatment, I think. And it's got this really nice pink, a brown, and then this taupe color. Um, literally, I've been throwing on the taupe color in my crease and then the brown color all over the lid and just kind of blending it out. It looks fine. That's what I've been doing. Kind of boring, I know. But hey, it's it's wet and wild. It's good. Um, now, for something I really don't normally do, um, the kind of the shit list of the month, First thing on here is going to be this Pop of Purple Limited Edition Great Lash Maybelline Mascara. Now when I got this, it's supposed to be purple. Well, I'm going to put it on the back of my hand. It looks purple, but then when you get on the eyelashes, it doesn't do anything. And it's, like, really disappointing. Um, and then the, also this Mega Plush Volume Express Waterproof Mascara by Maybelline. It's in kind of this teal tube. Um, now, I don't like the formula, even though I usually adore wet mascara. It's got this cool brush. Like, I love the brush. I do. Except for this part where it bends. What the hell? What the hell? I can't put the mascara on because of this bendy ass fracking thing. And that's the new word I'm going to be using quite a lot is fracking. <laughs> but yeah, I hate this thing. It's like really bendy. However, I do like the color of the mascara, which I've just now gotten all over my finger. 
and um, the mascara itself is kind of sucky because it's a gel mousse formula so that just tells me it's going to make my lashes extra dark so I have to put on something like this beforehand and really build it up and I'll put this on after it and then it really makes the color you know it makes them super super dark so and then the other thing this month I'm actually I'm having a hard time with this I had to put my glasses on so much better <laughs> okay so this thing from ELF, which I purchased at Walgreens for $10, I believe, or $9.95 or something like that. And I, I got the Evil Queen. Now, it's really cute and everything, I suppose, but unless you're like a teenager, it's kind of pointless, I guess. Um, okay, now, all together, I'm going to add this up. For a dollar, I can usually get the ELF lashes. The glue is shit. For another dollar, I can get a quad and then another quad. So that's three dollars all together now. Dollar eye primer, that's four, five, six, seven. So for seven dollars, I could have gotten all of this. But because it's Disney, you have to pay the extra three dollars for the names. Um, I cannot stand the eyeshadows. Um, this is one by Vanity, Narcissistic, and Potion. Um, the only one, that, in my opinion, that does any good whatsoever is this dark one here. Potion. If you look closely, my white is broken. It broke. Guess what? I didn't even use it. That's just shows you how crappy a quality these are. So this is broken. First in the land is broken. Majesty, that's a pretty good color. I'll say that. If they put this out in a single, I'd buy it. Peddler's Cloak, that's a pretty good color. I like it a lot. And this one, which is Poison Apple, I do not like. I'm sorry. I think it's uh, not dark enough. So, anyway. Um, the Whip and Cheat colors yeah I guess whatever obviously the only thing I really think is worth the money is the primer potion because it is their primer potion but for a dollar I can get a full sized one rather than just this little half size here uh, their eyeliner it's the eyeliner shit I'm just gonna be honest and frankly um, this little illustration here with the evil queen day and night looks I could have gone without because I'm never gonna use it um, and the mirror is just a mirror to me. So, anyway, um, I really did not like this palette. I think I wasted my money. But, what are you going to do? I mean, I'll get a hit and a miss once in a while. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. I will be coming back soon with more. Um, yeah. And I hope that my eye contact in this video was better than last time. So. Anyway, um, I'll talk to y'all soon, and Blackbird Molly, over now. Bye.